I need your advice on Friedrich air conditioner troubleshooting. For their window ACs, EF is not an error code, it means error free. Error O2 means the voltage is too high like a blown fuse, while O2 through O5 mean there's a defective sensor. I've never heard of a notice that looks like an error code to indicate it was not malfunctioning. A lot of them just have two or three green lights if it is running fine. The 10 error code means it turned off because the room temp got below 40 degrees, while error 07 means the indoor coil got below freezing. If I'm running the AC when it is that cold, I have problems other than the AC doing its job too well. And the other problem is that I do not have a window AC. The error codes tend to be universal, unless you have a heat pump. For example, 09 means the unit is cycling more than three times an hour, so it is either under high load or undersized. So I need an additional window AC, or need to move to somewhere not so hot. If you get a flashing error code 13, it means the pressure jumper wire is having problems. You may need to clean the coil, fix the fan motor, check the air vents for blockages, check the filters for clogs or see if there's refrigerant in the unit. I'm trying to think of what you have not included checking on that list. Making sure the unit isn't failing to run because you didn't actually turn on the AC. Oh and if the screen is blank and the lights are dead, check the breaker because it isn't getting power. Flipping the breaker or changing those fuses is at least something I can try myself. I do not know how to see if the refrigerant is gone, but I have to call a service person anyway because I cannot recharge that myself. Yeah, that's due to environmental regulations. They even removed Freon from asthma inhalers for fear of it getting out. So they certainly don't want do-it-yourselfers accidentally leaking a whole bottle out into the atmosphere. Sometimes I think a thing has a whole bunch of error codes, and I can't tell what it is or what it last had. Push the heat and high fan buttons at the same time for 3 seconds to bring up the error code menu, then toggle through them via the temperature up button. You can clear them by holding the temperature down button for 3 seconds. Messing with an Xbox is less convoluted. If the unit has ice on it either turn it off to thaw or set it to run on fan until the ice melts. Which theoretically would cool us down a little like blowing a fan over a block of ice. Or you can sit around a bucket of ice while waiting for the repairman to come.